So you have finished your fundamentals training and you're asking yourself, where do I go from here? At this point, you have several options depending on where your interest lies. If in your area you have deeper sites or you have some wrecks that you would like to discover, the GOE Tech One program is something that will be ideal for you. On the other hand, if you're interested in a water-filled cave, seeing the beauty that is lying below the ground and exploring some of the sites, the GOE K1 program would be ideal for you. In this program, as a prerequisite, we will have the fundamentals tech rating that you need to have. This class will provide the necessary skills and a solid foundation for what will be covered during the K1 class. In the K1 class, we are going to be covering things that rely heavily on the skills introduced during your fundamental class. Showing up to class with solid skills like buoyancy, propulsion, communication, and trim will make it very accessible for you to understand the cave-specific skills that the class will be presenting. As the week progresses and your training, you will be learning things that will be applying specifically to the environment what to do to lay a line inside a cave, what to do if you ever get separated from this line, what to do if at any point there is a separation in the team, but most important, how to avoid those things from happening. K1 class is a great class that will show you the beauty of the overhead environment as well as to how to properly plan and execute all the dives once the class is completed. After taking the K1 class, or if you already hold a K1 rating, the K2 might be something you would like to consider. GOE has a prerequisite of at least 25 dives between one level of training and the other. So if you have completed your 25 non-training dives after your K1 class, K2 might be something you would like to consider. Things that we covered at the K2 program include extended penetration into the environment, the use of additional bottles that we carry in the system, complex navigation, restrictive passages, as well as decompression. This is a class that will open a lot of doors for you. As a K1 diver, you get to see the introduction of the overhead environment. The K2 specializes on further penetration and complexity into this environment. Additional step to the K2 class with a lot of experience comes extended penetrations into the environment in forms of the utilization of DPV vehicles inside the environment. As you are gaining more and more experience, you might decide to take the different levels that GOE offers in our CAVE curriculum, keeping in mind that it all starts with the fundamental set of skills learned during your fundamental class. This set of skills will be extremely helpful and necessary as you're moving along through all the different cave curriculum areas that we have to offer.